here's the deal. Oh my gosh. I am shaking. Okay, so Harold took the boys to the store to get like um, donuts and bananas and stuff. So we only have a few minutes to do this. <sighs> my period is supposed to start in two days. We're up here in North Carolina with my family. Um, and I wasn't going to test because last month um, I was with my family and I took a test and I found out I was pregnant and I got to do it with my sister and it was amazing. God, we trust you excited if this is what is in the plan for us God um, prepare our hearts um, and we just thank you for every blessing that you've already given us Lord we love you so much amen amen okay all right I feel ready now one two three And then the next day I had what's called a chemical pregnancy and so I lost the pregnancy and it was a lot and it weighed on me. Um, I don't want to go into it too much but um, it was like a one day and then it was gone. Um, and so this time around I wasn't going to test because I was like I just want to wait you know like I'll just wait <laughs> who knows like two weeks or something if I miss it. Um, but I just couldn't stop thinking about the fact that I'm up here with my parents. Um, and I don't know the next time that I'll see my dad after this. You know, it could be like a few months or something. So I just didn't want to miss the opportunity if I was pregnant um, to be able to tell him in person, you know. I have felt some like symptoms this time. And last time I didn't feel any symptoms. So I like really did not think I was pregnant um, last time. But this time I have felt like nauseous a few times where I was like oh that's weird like I had some cookies and I was like oh man I do not feel good after that Harold was laying next to me and we're like you know trying to snuggle with me and I was like oh I feel like nauseous like you gotta move um and then even last night I was laying with Truett um and I like got up and I like sat up or something I felt nauseous so um you know that's always my first pregnancy sign is uh, feeling nauseous um, so that does give me a little bit more hope since last time I didn't feel anything and this time I do. Um, so <laughs> I, I, I brought these from home. I'm shaking. I could not sleep last night. I had, I had two of them and I took one yesterday. Okay. I didn't film it or anything. Um, just don't want any, oh shoot, where is it? want anybody to come down here um I didn't film it yesterday let's see let's see you guys if you can see that I don't know if you guys can see that faint line so I took it and I, I didn't set the timer but I could it just was one line you know and I was like okay I'm not and I was like okay now I can stop thinking about it but I kept looking at it looking at it and then this like, very tiny line popped up and I was like Am I imagining that? Am I imagining like, like, like I could, couldn't tell if it was there or not? And then after a while, I was like, okay, like I can tell it's a line. But like my brain just couldn't process, you know? I was like, I think because of what happened before, like I'm, I'm not trusting, like I don't know if I'm pregnant, you know? Like normally you would see two lines and be like, you're pregnant, but because it just was one day and then it was gone, so um. What I did today was, like, and that was like in the afternoon, and so um, I got my morning pee. <sighs> I was going to just wait. I was going to wait because I don't want to like be stressed out about, of course, I think like, is it going to happen again? Um, <sighs> but I could just keep it to myself um, and nobody know, and then I could go through it again, and then I would tell them, you know, like that's what happened last time. like. I told my sister and my mom and I hadn't told Harold yet and so or my dad and so by the time that I told them I was like I was not in but now I'm not and I just like cried in their arms which I'm like grateful for them but um 
you know, I'm so grateful for that that moment of joy that I got to have with my sister telling her. So, um, you know, we're, I'm not going to try to think that what happened last time is going to happen this time. I just want to, I want to feel the joy if, if I am <laughs> by a miracle pregnant this morning. <sighs> and then I don't know how I'm going to tell Harold. <laughs> I have no idea. But we'll think of something. Um, but we have to be quick because they're probably coming back soon. So let me get the pee. God, you are good. And God, I trust you. Um, thank you for just this possibility, Lord, right now. This moment that I thank God just be with me. <laughs> three minutes left on the clock um so yesterday yesterday when I saw it like yesterday it looked like it was negative right but then like it slowly you know I saw that line and at first like I really just like couldn't process it at all you know I was just like staring at it like I don't know I don't know what this means you know but then throughout the day like I started to just like I think accept it. I could feel my body starting to get like, I'm not anxious, but like nervous, like all the nerves, you know, were coming of like the possibility and, you know, and oh my gosh, I know this thing that nobody else around me knows right now and how am I going to tell them? And I really cannot think of a, a way to tell Harold. I actually, last night, I was just going to take the test with him, so, but I was like, ah, I just don't know. I kind of want to get his like thoughts of like would he want to take the test with me or would he still want me to surprise him like I have all the other ones and so last night I was just like you know babe can we talk about this I told him how I was felt like I would be nervous to take another test again and he kind of said exactly what I had thought of like what my original plan was was like just don't take one you know like just wait you know and then I felt a couple weeks go by and then the toilet from upstairs is flushing. If a couple weeks go by um, and then you take it, then you find out you are, then you'll be like six weeks along or something like that, you know? Um, and he's been traveling a lot too. He's been gone for like the past like three weeks he's been traveling. Um, and so I, I think he just, he has no clue. I mean, zero clue. He really has no clue this time um, because I'm pretty sure he thinks like there's a 0% chance that I would have gotten pregnant a this quick and b with him traveling so much um which is also kind of like how I feel so like this is gonna be like a true miracle <sighs> I don't know what I'm gonna do it I have no idea how I'm gonna tell him I could not sleep last night thinking about it okay five six, it's about five minutes about five minutes okay here we go here we go here we go Faint, but you can tell. You can tell this time. Let me see if it's any darker. It looks a little darker than the one that I did yesterday. I don't know why, but like I just want to see like a really dark, dark line, but I haven't even missed my period yet, so I mean it makes sense that it wouldn't be. But it does look darker than that one. 